everyone, my name's Eva and I'm a mom who happens to love wine and needs it all the time because I have so much going on in my life. Laundry, taxi driver, cook, the list goes on. Hi Eva, uh, Hi. my name's Paul. I'm a journalist and wine critic. We're gonna taste the Chardonnay tonight. He's had too much wine. Uh, yeah. yeah, it's a 2013 Riata uh, Chardonnay, a Egan Vineyard from Sonoma cool climate Chardonnay. It's made though by Jameson Ranch Vineyards, which is down in um, Carneros, the southernmost part of uh, Napa. So let's get started, shall we? Shall we? Yes. Okay, so I already poured myself wine, so. You did? Oh my god, wow. That's good, thank you. Let's sniff it. I feel like dancing right now. Like, I feel like now watch me whip. Now watch me nay nay. Like Chardonnay nay. Yeah. Did, have you seen that meme? I have That's not funny to you, but for I smell cars, new car, vanilla, fresh smell when you get your car washed, you fresh fruit? laundry, sunflowers, uh, tulips. Let's uh, go on and taste, shall we? Yeah. Oh wow! Very creamy. De la crap. I will go first. Okay, red apple. I'm getting a little bit of pomegranate, maybe. I'm getting some some pear, some some uh, stone fruit, uh, but a little bit of tropical fruit too. A little pineapple kind of. So I'd say this is an interesting mix of a cool climate and a warm climate Chardonnay. It's got elements of both. So what do you think? I'm not yeah. the weather woman. I would say that this would go good with any kind of climate in my house, especially when you have kids running around. Uh, I can imagine making a mess. It's a medium climate. Medium climate. I, not I like warm, that. not cool, but in between. Uh, what do you think of the temperature of this Chardonnay? Do you, you like the temperature of it? No, I think that we could have put like we could put some ice in this, and it would be a lot some ice. like more refreshing. I love that word, by the way, refreshing. Yeah. Yeah. Like when you get out of the shower, refreshing. Nothing exceptional about it, but. I think we go with uh, certainly go with food well. I would use it for my pastas. Um, finish not so not remarkable. Not so long, no. Yeah. yeah. No. You're out there. You're shopping. You're pushing your cart. You see the wine. You buy it. Uh, I wouldn't buy it. I think it's about time now to give this wine a rating, and we have a, a ding mm -hmm. system here now. One ding means barely passable, and two dings means okay in a pinch. Three dings means pretty damn good. I'm gonna give. I'm gonna go like this. That was a ding and a half. 1.5 dings. Oh Your turn. Oh, oh really? I do have a ding, come on. A solid ding. Ultimately, you gave it a ding and a half? Yeah. Yeah, you know, a half ding because it's it's a decent food wine. Not a, mm -hmm. not a yeah. resounding yeah. recommendation from either of us. Yeah. 